Cable 8. Definition. Looking at an electrical outlet. Solution. What a sight. An hour solution to fun with a fun on television is Definition. And stepping into view is the host of our show, Jim Perry. Why, thank you, David. Come on in. Welcome to Definition. We're playing Definition this week with crack sportscasters Dan Matheson and Pat Morrison. You go all over the place, right, with the NHL games, but you don't go all over Canada. Well, only in the playoffs. We get into Canada in the playoffs. But generally, we're in the States in Quebec City. That, well, that's got to be fun, though. Just, do you like to travel? Do you like to get out like that? Sure. sure. The games are fun. The only part is you don't like to go away from home for two weeks at a time. Oh, do you go, do you go that, that sometimes that long? Well, that's right. Yeah, you're just going with the team all the way through and everything like that. Talking about the playoffs, now, you, you probably covered what, what has been called the greatest hockey game ever, right? Well, that was 1972 when Canada won it in a very dramatic eighth game against the Soviet Union, the first time the pros had ever played the Soviets. And that's not only the greatest hockey game ever played, I think that was the greatest sporting event of the stage because it was, I mean, it was really terrific. There were 3,000 Canadians in the Moscow ring yeah. and, you know, they, they had been down so badly and then to come back and win it in the final seconds on Paul Anderson's goal. It was really a thrill for me. I'm a sports fan, so. Oh, yeah. Oh, you gotta be. I guess you guys have got to be. No, that, that's not a facetious remark. No. It's one thing to do it, it's quite another thing to be a, a fan of it. Well, I think that's the point. I mean, a lot of people think that you become jaded because you're working in sports, but I'm still a fan. I mean, I'll still pick up the paper first thing in the morning to see it. Well, I, well, I must say, it reflects in both of your work that you guys are fans, because well, you. you do it with enthusiasm. Well, good to have you back here again. Let us welcome back with Pat, our challenger, as she just joined us yesterday, Victoria Morgan Stern. Hi, Victoria. And with that is our champion. She's won twice, trying for a third win, Joanne Parrin. Hi, Joanne. We play the best two and three. We'll get into the match with this definition. Well, that would have to be groups of circus trapeze artists. So what that preface was was Dave not as his microphone. That's what that was. <laughs> Wait while I find the card. What this has to be is group of circus trapeze artists. Starting with the challengers. Pat, give a letter away that you do not want. The give away is that. You know, that and that means Victoria can take a letter that she thinks she can use. An A? There is no A. No letter of the board, no guess. That group of, tra of circus trapeze artists. Dan, give one away. Give away an X. There is no X. Go ahead and take a letter. I'll take an I. An I. One I. One I that goes here with a five little word. You put a letter of the board. Either of you can give me one guess. Do you know group of circus trapeze artists? There's a signal time is up. They're going to pass to give a letter away. Okay, I'll give away a um, Y. No Y. Take a letter, Victoria. A B. B is in boy. No B. Oh, gee, had an idea. Nope, not there. And we go back to Dan to give one away. Give away a U. No U. Take a letter to Dan. I'll take an E. There is one E. One E in the second word here. Oh. Well, with each of the two words, you know groups of circus trapeze artists. We go to pass. Give one away. I'll give away a uh, D. D is a victor is a good choice. Victoria, take a letter. An S, please. S is in Sam. That's a great choice. Three of them. One at the beginning of this word. Second at the beginning of this word. Third at the end of that word. For the first definition of the match, groups of circus trapeze artists. Swing set. Swing set is what it is. And the challenge is leading to one another. That's the match. That's the match. 